Hey, what's going on, everyone? Good morning. This is Mr. Thacker uh, from Clara B. Ford Academy Science Class. And uh, what I wanted to go over today is everyone knows about what's going on with the Hurricane Harvey and Harvey, Hurricane Irma. Um, uh, lots and lots of people have been affected by it. No power. Puerto Rico, for example. There are places in Puerto Rico that is not going to have power for months. You know, we know that Florida, a lot of places in Florida have no power right now. A lot of places in Texas, Houston have no power. So what would happen when you don't have power? Like how would you be able to charge your phone, for example? People need to communicate. And uh, what I want to go over today is how you can charge your phone by using stuff you can find around the house. For example, everyone got a 9-volt battery. So you get a 9-volt battery. You need a car charger, ordinary car charger, and everyone knows if one of these pens, all these little pens have these little springy things inside it. So you need one of these spring things and of course your charger. So let me show you this really quick. First thing you gotta do is plug your USB into the car charger, right? That's all you need to do. Next thing. Take one of these spring things and all car chargers have a metal piece on their sides, right? You can tape it on it using insulating tape, you know, however. I'm just going to show you this the easy way right now. Take one of these springs, attach it right there. So now you have it. All I did was slip it in, slide it in, and there you go. Next thing, I'm going to go ahead and put that spring just to test it out. And then take that and touch there. If you can see, let me show you this. Light. Again, I want you to see that light up, the car charger. So I'm going to take that and I'm going to put the string. You see there's light. So now I am going to go ahead and charge my phone. Put that in there. Once again, what you do, you take the spring and you put it in that right there. And the car charger, you will complete the connection, the circuit, by inserting it there. So, check this out. Spring. And I want you to see that this phone is going to be charging. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a phone that is charging right now. You can see that. The phone is charging. And that's a simple way. Once again, you got to complete the connection. Okay? You got to make sure you complete the connection in order for the phone to charge. That's your completed connection. That is a phone that is charging right now. That's a phone that is charging. Right there. 